This is the first video I've ever made like this that's gonna be like super long and scripted and stuff. Bear with me as I go through all of these rares and whatnot. Sorry if I sound different or stupid and I'm sick right now. I've been sick since Friday. I don't like feel good at all but the reason it's not all rares and it's most of them is because I either forgot where places are for certain rares or I haven't found um, all of them. Uh, either way, I hope you guys enjoy, I hope this guide helps you guys out, and, yeah. So, the first one coming up that we have here is actually Chef. Uh, nothing too special, honestly. It's right here at Lockport, it's at this, uh, building right here. Um, all the way at the end. Uh, you don't get it from killing this guy, but you can. Um, but it spawns on either here or here. I don't know if it spawns on here, but... Yeah, it spawns on one of these, and yeah. Alright, the next one we have up here is Clown Outfit, or Clown Set, whatever you want to call it. Uh, basically, it's at school, which is right next to Ashland there. If you didn't see that, I'll leave a frame up on the screen. But basically, you come in here, and it's on one of these tables. The next one up that we have here is Durag. Uh, basically, Durag spawns up here at the clinic in Huntington. And uh, all you gotta do is come over here, go ahead and stop. You can go around through the front or you can break the window, either one works. And it'll be on one of these three beds. Next up is the fedora that spawns in Salem. Um, it's kind of rare, but uh, yeah, it's definitely findable. I found it a lot of times. It spawns uh, right here, I think. Next one up is Hustler, and it's right here at the uh, motel above the observatory lake. And basically, you want to go up these stairs, come into here, and I'll be on this bed right here. Alright, so the next one up we have here is a NOS location. You can get it from going to the tower. And in the tower, you can actually find um, <coughs> Admiral Clothing. But what you want to do is go to the staircase and go all the way up. One, two, three, whatever. And it should be right here in the corner. The next one up is a regional airport. Um, it's the uh, airline captain. And basically you want to go through here, up the stairs, cut this window out, and it should be sitting right here. If you don't happen to find it over there, you can come all the way from there to here, go through the doors, and it can be sitting here just like that. <laughs> the next one that we have coming up here is the one at Destroyer Shipwreck, which is the Bandit Straw. Uh, basically, um, it's a Destroyer right here, and all you gotta do is you know, just get out of your car or come here, whatever you want to do. And it should be on the chair right here at the front of the boat. While I'm on my way to the next location, I'm actually going to be explaining Gilly and the jet black vest. Basically, Gilly will be at any of the spots that I pop up on the screen here. And basically, jet black vest also spawns there. It doesn't, it's not a natural spawn. But it can spawn there on a zombie, and you have to kill the zombie and whatnot. Basically, Gilly is found in the small green box at each heli crash. And basically, whenever you boot that heli crash, there is a chance that it can spawn the ghillie suit. However, you are not guaranteed the ghillie suit, and it is very, very, very hard to get the pieces that you need. If you do somehow end up getting full new ghillie then congrats to you for grinding for that all hunt. The next I rare love. is the military flight captain or whatever and it spawns over here in the hangar. Uh, uh, and it's no not idea. a natural spawn, it's just the zombies and they drop the stuff. The next hats are at university. Uh, hatched hat spawns in here. Uh, right behind this know? black crate. The next one is Paper Hat, and it spawns on one of the tables up there in the second story in the main building. The next and final hat that's at university is Soda Boy Hat or Number One Soda Hat, the SpongeBob reference and shit. Basically, you come up here, you go all the way down, and it's either going to be spawned on the table or on one of these beds. 
So the next one up is Motocross, which spawns up here in Eden. Uh, it spawns at this barn right here, and basically, uh, you're gonna want to go all the way to the back or the front, it doesn't matter. You open the door, and it will spawn right on top of this awesome machine. The next one is the full actual pirate set, and I'll pop up a map that I made of all the locations that I have found. I'm not sure if there's any more, but these are the ones that I found. You'll know if he's there, there's always a boat. Uh, there's not always the zombie, but there will be a piece if you find a fresh pirate spot. The next one that we have is the pirate costume, which can be found at um, the Hastings uh, house, where that one guy spawns. Or it can be found over here at the laundry room in Salem. And basically it could spawn the hat right here and the eye patch up here. The next one is Black Plague, which is literally not even that far away from Fedora or Laundry Room. And basically you come up here to church, you can come up here, and it's right here, uh, spawns behind the podium. White Plague is entirely different spawn from Black Plague. It spawns all the way up Beaufort, go down here by the water. And there's a cave entrance, you go in there, you kill the zombie, which is White Plague Doctor, and he has a chance of dropping the White Plague set. Rasta Hat. I'm not so sure about this one, but what I do know is that if you go across the road of here, from Salem all the way to Eden, maybe all the way to campground, and you just look off to the left and the right, you'll most often than not find camping events camping events are where i find ross to have most often the next one up is ushanka which actually spawns that mansion it can also spawn at uh soviet locations uh like the spetsnaz events and the only one that i know for sure that it that uh the event spawns at is right here at the house above campground the next one up is colonial set which if you come right over here to the laundry room in ashland um it will spawn uh, right here on top of the washers and dryers and whatnot. So you just come over here and it should spawn right here. The next one up is Judge. Uh, judge is obtained by going all the way up here and either getting it from right here behind the podium or killing Judge. Another useful tip whenever coming up here is that Sombrero can actually spawn right here. I don't know if it spawns on this table, but I know that it spawns definitively here. The next one up is Bowler Hat and Black Round Glasses. You can actually get them from this funeral event that's right outside of um, the Judge place at Ashland. And basically, there is multiple spawns for funeral. You can note them down if you find them across the map. But yeah, this is uh, one that I found that it definitely spawns at. Next one up is Sailor Cap. It can actually spawn at the docks at Mackinac, which uh, is to the left side of Mackinac. But the one that I like to go to is over here by Destroyer Shipwreck. And basically what you want to do is get out and go up here and you can go up all the way up and it will spawn somewhere in this vicinity. Real quickly here, I'm gonna go ahead and go over the balaclavas. Balaclava, the the black, navy, red, and all of balaclava all spawn at pr prison bus events or at the mansion. Uh, the, I'm confident uh, in a prison bus spawn that I almost go to all the time. It's right here by this house on the road either I think it's around here. For the next balaclavas, there's orange, pink, and white. And those come from the bank uh, van event. And you can find them right here, right here, and like somewhere around here too. The next one up is Red Beret. Red Beret spawns right here at NAS and this chopper. The next one up is the burglar set. Burglar can spawn either here or here in one of those houses. Big Boss Headband spawns on Big Boss and he can actually spawn in the uh, basement of this house at NAS. He also spawns on Huron, mainly at Huron, over at Old Chapel, somewhere uh, around it. The next rare coming up is the Kubaki Mask. Kubaki Mask actually has two separate locations, but they're both in banks. 
Um, Ubaki Mass spawns right here in Fairview. You go in here, you open it up, and Kubaki Mass can spawn right here. It's the same way for the bank in Ashland right around here. Same building design and everything, just copy paste it over. You can't miss it. The next one up is US Ranger set, which spawns here in the barn right outside of regional. Um, it is this barn right here. And all you gotta do is go up here. And there's a chance for a zombie to spawn here, actually. He can spawn here or in the tower. But uh, the stuff naturally spawns right here. The next one up is Jeremiah Trapper, and you can actually find it by coming to this house all the way out in the middle of fucking nowhere. Uh, come out of here, and it can spawn on top of this bed right here. Also, he can spawn somewhere outside up here, or he can spawn in the house. So the next spot is Guy Fox Mask, which spawns at j the Judge Basement of Ashland. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and come over here go down into the basement and it's right behind this wall the next one up is the um, pink, pink sport shades and the black leather holster uh, which can be found at all of these locations that I display on the screen right now basically it appears in the form of a party bus a pink party bus if you get the gold one then that's not the one it spawns at but if you luckily get the pink one or purple one whatever you want to call it then you're in luck the next one is Rogue Gas Mask, which spawns over here uh, on Mackinac, next to this hotel. And he can be around here, or over here, or over there. The next set is Tan Urban Camo, uh, Tan Gun Holster, Dusty Brown Gun Holster, and Tan Business Suit. You can find those up at Regional Airport right around here. And basically, it's by an airplane. There's just like five zombies or something and they all have uh rares on them and the last but most certainly not least we have the maroon set and we also have the um all and we have all the bandanas <coughs> so this is for rose tint glasses maroon urban camo whatever all that stuff uh basically he spawns in this hangar right here and he can drop uh, any of the items that he has um, <clears throat> for all the bandanas this is a very reliable spot I have seen every single bandana in this box so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, leave a comment below if this helped you at all I don't know if it did it may or may not I don't know I didn't list all the rares that I actually got because I forgot where like compression shirts were and camo stuff was unfortunately but I hope that this could at least help you know some people out so yeah I'll see you guys later